and welcome guys to this new video of the online media. Today I'm going to be showing you what exactly is the shop pay and how does it actually works. So in this tutorial, what we want to be doing here is to explain everything you needed to know about the shop pay and how it can be benefit for your online store and of course for beginners, advanced and so much more. First of all, what is the actual shop pay? The shop pay is the Shopify accelerated checkout solution that makes the buying process fast, secure and seamless for your customers. It saves customers payment and shipping information and this allows them to make payments and shipping information let's say in a very just easy way with just a few clicks not only does it streamline the checkout process but it also offers features like installment payments and coupling of setting for deliveries now one of the benefits for this great shop pay is that you can have faster checkout with save with payment shipping details um, customers purchasing in seconds I believe is gonna be really awesome increased conversion rating now the conversion rate is going to be helping you to make quicker, easier checkout process, reduce car abutment, and even boost sales. And lastly, you have the installment of the payments and the sustainability because they offset the carbon emissions from deliveries, appealing the environmentally conscious consumers. So if you are into that, this is a really great, great uh, news for you. Now, how does this actual application, how does this section work inside the Shopify? So first of all, we have the customer select the shop pay at the actual checkout. When they wanted to buy an actual process of a product, they should be seeing here that one of the payments when they choose a specific option of an application of a store directly inside the Shopify, they do have the actual element of, let's say, buying with the actual new section of Shopping. You can enter the information at once. So the first time a customer uses the Shopping, they entered the payment and shipping details, the information securely added all those elements directly into the store. How you can add this directly inside your Shopify? Well, what you want to do is to focus inside settings. Inside the settings, let's go and focus inside the section that says payment. And now inside payment, what you can do is to go for managed. And to manage, what you can do is to choose an actual provider. In this case, I can look out here and look out for a shop. If you don't see the shop, what you can do is to look out for this new party directly inside the applications and look out for shop pay and go and look out for Shopify application store. Depending on the country you're currently living, you might be seeing that the Shopify is available or it might not be available into your store. Even they actually have the compatibility with the store, depending on what is the actual plan that you're currently having with your actual store. Now, lastly, of course, is to setting up your shop pay into the Shopify store. If you don't see this, what you can do is to go directly into the settings and check out the compatibility of your actual store. So make sure that your actual store comes with the address inside this element. Otherwise, you might not be eligible to get started in. So if you wanted to change that, what you can do is to go into settings. Let's go and focus now into the store details. Into the store details, I'm going to change some of my actual billing information. Here I choose this element. Now let's say that instead of Mexico, I choose another country that is available into Shopify. For example, Canada. And here into Canada, I delete this address and I just type, let's say something like this. Here automatically it's gonna be added to all this information. So make sure they have a really active and real, um, let's say address in order for making this process. Now, if I focus into payments, you should see that the payments are should be now enabled inside managed. I'm going to go and look out for change provider. And here I look out for shop pay. Once again, if you don't see this, let's go back. Let's reload the page into the Shopify app store. And you should see that we are now able to install the shop pay. So I hit now into install. This one should be directing us into the installation process. So what you need to do is just to grant the access between the Shopify and your Shopify store. Once you hit into the installation, what it's going to be asking you is to make the activation of this Shopify payments. So I go and click in here. So here, what you want to do is to configure the Shopify installments. If you wanted to offer installment payments, click into Managed or switch to Shopify payments to activate the Shopify payments and enable the option for the shop pay installment. So you can set the maximum or minimum orders values eligible for installments. So I just hit now into complete my account setup and click now into save. Choose the type of business that you're currently having 
the business number, the city, your personal details, your product details, number of the custom brailing statement, the banking information, and so much more elements that they need to be filled in order to activate this element. And there you have it guys, that is how we can activate, how we can use the Shopify, the Shop Hey, of course, into your actual store. Make sure that your store is eligible inside the country you're currently living, otherwise you might not be eligible. But if you don't, you have to worry about that because there are other options to choose if your store does not allow it. Just go directly inside Managed, and here into Managed, look out for a third party. And here into a third party, just choose an actual element, currency that your banking account enables and accepts. Well guys, there you have it. A really easy way of how we can actually use ShopPay. What is it and how does it actually work? It can help increase your customer rates and customer satisfaction, making it the most half for any Shopify store. So thank you guys for watching. If you found this story helpful, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and share this video. Stay tuned for more only media and to my able tips. Until next time.